Hi guys, welcome to Recorea Share. My name is Sherry and this is my travel journal. I'd like to share with you some of the best memories that I had over the Christmas holiday. Is it too late to ask how you spent your Christmas holiday in January? Oh well, I had to try. <laughs> if you're new here, Karibu sana and it's nice to have you on board. And to all my current subbies, thank you so much for being loyal. And don't forget to subscribe, like, share this video. Alright, shall we? My family Christmas tradition is always simple. We like to order in lunch and by lunch, I mean nyamachoma and ugali. Other times we cook chicken and order chapatis because nobody likes cooking during Christmas. We snack a lot and this helps us to avoid being in the kitchen. Usually, during Christmas holidays, hotels are too busy during the day and you can wait to be served food for quite some time. And that's why we prefer eating at home before going out. We leave the house at around 2 p.m. and decide where to go. And once we arrive at the destination we decided on, we get settled in, we order drinks and find activities to do. Then later on, order dinner and then we go home. Some Christmas, we have guests coming over and this is when we die in the kitchen cooking. Ha <laughs> ha! Just kidding. We love hosting. Welcome to Naivasha Kongoni Lodge. We discovered this place when we got lost going to Naivasha West Beach Camp. If you haven't watched that video, please do so. To be honest with you guys, I did not want to come to this place. Reason being, it looked quite small from the outside and I actually thought we were just going to watch animals. But my sister insisted that we should give this place a shot and we went in. Guys, I saw donkey ride and I laughed thinking who in their right mind would want to ride a donkey. <laughs> then I saw this carriage passes by. Oh wow. And I just wanted to ride a donkey. I mean, I've never seen anything like that before. I wanted to experience it. Wow, this place is so beautiful. Do not judge a book by its cover. Remember how I told you that Christmas time is always so busy? Well, that you always get to wait for your meals? Look at us. 
waiting and waiting and waiting guys we waited like almost 20 minutes before we got service and imagine now if you were hungry you came in hungry you haven't eaten anything yeah 20 minutes of waiting to even get a hi you're welcome anyways christmas tip 101 come prepared eat something on the way and we waited and waited oh i turned my head to the right and to the left oh and waited and the weather started looking funny it looked like it's gonna rain oh but the view was so beautiful look at that the rain looks like it's gonna pour in one two three four The rain finally stopped and we are headed to the reception area to pay for the bike ride and the donkey ride that we just saw. Oh, by the way guys, I forgot to mention, the waiters finally came and we got service. We've left mom and dad having tea and we put our orders on hold because we didn't want to lose on daylight. We wanted to show some few videos. The sceneries are just breathtaking. I had to take a moment to just take it all in. Wow. Look at that. Look at the hills and the clear skies, the clouds. Just beautiful. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi, guys. Welcome back to our channel. Oh my God, there's an incoming car. But. There we go. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry about that. So we are at Kongoni Resort. Is it a resort? Yeah. A camping ground, something like that. Um, and we're going to do some fun activities. Um, we are going for a donkey ride. <laughs> I know, guys, it's insane, but yes, we're totally excited. Right, baby? Yeah, which is only affordable on the holidays. Not yeah, actually, much. the donkey ride, this is the best part. The only, you can only ride a donkey during a holiday. Holidays. And today's Christmas. So, Merry Christmas, guys. And uh, it was raining. The weather was a bit iffy. So, it but gla it's a bit clear now. If you, yeah, I can't show you the camera. See some sun. Hi Esther. <laughs> That's my other sister. Yes, so at least it has cleared, so that's why we want to take advantage of the fact that it's not raining anymore. And then we'll go take that ride. Alright, follow us. Bye. Follow us. Bye. Bye. At the reception, we got to find out that they have various activities such as boat ride which was 4,000 shillings for an hour for 7 people. Uh, they have bird watching, uh, bike rides, donkey rides. So we are doing a bike ride which is 300 shillings for an hour and a donkey ride is 100 shillings per person and you have to be at least 5 people. So, apparently, uh of the rain the guy had to leave so we will not be able to do that donkey ride so we've decided to just uh, do a bike ride instead 
but uh, just this is some of the activity guys <laughs> it's like you guys would need so there's a bike ride donkey ride observation hut there's a safari bar and bonfire yeah, those are some of the things they have but for me i think i was more excited about the donkey ride I don't know if I can be able to come back here tomorrow so that I can do it, but if guess I do, of course I'll let you know. Okay guys, I just want to show you like a sneak peek of why this donkey ride was going to be special. Well, it's, you know, just, so there's a carriage, yeah? And <laughs> I'm getting there, don't worry. So there's, uh, it's a whole carriage. I don't know how I'm gonna turn my camera, so I'll just have to turn myself. So here it is. I know, right? This would have been so epic. See the seat. I mean, clearly, you guys can even see the droplets of rain. So, hmm, I'm sad. And the donkeys were like dressed up. I cannot, not literally like dressed up, but uh, yeah, they kind of like horses, but it's a dog. Yeah. Anyway, that's just sad. Let's just do the bike ride because we have like an hour to do that. Alrighty. When they took a bike back again. Here we go. Got my bike ready. One, two, go. Uh oh, what's happening? Okay, one, wait. Looks like I need help. A little bit of support, yeah? Okay, baby, let's do this. One, okay, Sherry, you got this. Come on, girl. Two, yeah. Oh, God damn it. Oh, one, two, push. Oh, really? Snap out of it. Okay, let's see. Yeah, there you go. I finally did it.
guys we are about to order dinner and my dad wants to take some pictures at the bonfire as we wait Wait, did I just see my dad trying to bust a move, dancing to Zilizopendwa, or was it just my imagination? Rewind! Okay, Mr. Papa, I see you trying to resist that move. Anyway guys, that has been it from us. Thank you so much for joining us. I hope you liked this video. Comment which was your favorite part about this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Until next video, bye.